What's up, everybody? Welcome to this week's episode of Zeba Games. This is episode 59. I feel 59. like when I say Zeba, I need to be like Zeba, Z Y B A Games. I feel like that's like more <laughs> catchy if I say that right. Because I, how do you spell Zeba? I don't know. Could be Z I B A. There is somebody uh, that comes <laughs> into my uh, comes into my channel every week and her her it's something Zai, but she pronounced it. It's almost spelled like Ziba, but she pronounced it Zai. Zaiba. Zai. Yeah, I think it's uh, what's her lovely, lovely Zaibar. Lovely Zaibar is what her name is. Oh, so she just she goes with hers. It. Huh? She it's Z Y B A R, and it's lovely Zaibar, but she pronounces it Zaibar. But we're Ziba. So every time you refer to her now, you need to say lovely Zibar. I did at first when I first saw her. <laughs> then she, I wait. Am I saying that right? She's like it's Zibar. I'm like oh, well. I thought it was Zeba. I stand corrected. <laughs> well, you spelled it wrong. Tell her that. <laughs> Anyways, this week's episode, we got a quite a bit of things, just like some fun things, some less fun things, and some other things, we'll say. But first, <laughs> if you guys want, you can always make sure to check out our Patreon, patreon.com slash Zeba Games. If you want to get in the giveaway this month's giveaway, you ready? You ready? You ready? I'm ready. It's right I'm ready. here. Oh. Ooh. A modeling one. And then I have a brand new one right here. This is this is a headset in this bad boy. It's just say the Y is silent. <laughs> yeah, bro. We yeah, got this, we got that's this headset. A, that's, a, that's, mm. a, that's a dope giveaway, dude. That's a pretty fresh one. When's the when's yours coming? Tomorrow. Jeez, I believe bro. Uh, it says tomorrow. That's like two weeks late. Yeah. What the heck? I, I mean, this one, this one, this one, and was, I pre-ordered it. This one was a little over a week late, but that's because for some reason FedEx decided to, to deliver it to somebody with the last name Nicholas <laughs> somewhere else. Somehow it showed up here. I don't know, man. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I was weird. I was like, whatever. You know what? There's worse things that could have happened. I got the headset. Yeah. My wife's I'm like, looking it up now, and it says expected to – wait, hold on. Did it change? Oh, no. What's up, Maybe. Josh? What's up, Cheesehead? What's up, Vibe? Cheesehead, what's going on? Expected, yeah, still – oh, yeah, still says expected to arrive, arrive tomorrow. So, okay. I think tomorrow. Yeah, we'll I feel bad for the UPS driver tomorrow. I work for UPS, but I feel bad for the driver tomorrow. I have a right. – uh, it's a quarter-inch thick – rubber mat three by four feet in your truck it's gonna be in the ups truck it's for this bad boy right here this big old huge oh. laser so i can set it on there and so that it can roll oh i see because so i can move it away from the wall this week i've been moving it a lot it's way far out from where it normally is it's normally back like you could normally you can barely see it. there's also a lot of tape and stuff on it right now mm -hmm. i'm going through the process of i think we talked about well you and me talked about it but i'm doing like I don't, I don't know what the word is. We called it zero airflow, right? So we're creating it so it has mm -hmm. to create a suction through there so that it pulls all right. the, the stinky stuff when it burns out of here. Right. Which, it's not too bad. I had to order another thing that will be here on tomorrow too. I got all kinds of stuff tomorrow. It's exciting. Yeah? It feels good when you get like a lot of stuff sent to your house all the time, you know? <laughs> I know. You're like, yes. Yeah, I'm always updating stuff around here. I feel like I'm kind of done though for a while. I feel like I'm, I'm good you getting to that point where you're like, I want to buy something so bad, but I don't know what to buy. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, <laughs> I was looking around. I'm like, I think I'm good. I think I'm good for now. So I'm wondering. <clears throat> yeah, keep talking real quick. Yeah, I'm just Whoa. the only okay, thing so I want to get. Go ahead. Is the PS5. <laughs> so I was messing with the audio. So when uh -huh. I switched it to this channel to the AG, when I had it on the other wireless for this headset. Uh -huh. so, so right, so there's two channels. We had the Xbox wireless headset channel and then the YXS wireless AG headset. When I was right. on wireless, if I turned it from game to party, it, it would go away. On this one, it does it. It's basically its own line. It doesn't touch. It doesn't touch the party to game chat mixer. Oh, the only that's problem cool. is is you have to turn the PC down on its own. You can't turn the PC down separately. Oh, you can turn the X like right. I can turn. So I see, which is fine. 
cookie dough. Cookie dough did save Yogami's life this week. It did. It re- uh, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I <laughs> tweeted something and everybody, you know, I know it seems like it's funny or stupid or silly. It is a true story. And I know people like, oh, you put true story in your tweet to be, you know, no, it was a true story. It was an absolutely <laughs> true story. I, Monday, I woke up, I had headaches, my, I had back aches. I just felt like crap all day. All day, I just felt like just terrible. Yeah. And it wasn't, it wasn't like sick, you know what I mean? Like I didn't feel like I had a cold. It's just like it just felt yeah. like, I don't know, like somebody ran over me with a tank. Not all the way, but just enough that I felt bad the next day, which I guess doesn't really require much with a tank. But anyway. So later on, I was in my bedroom and I was about to sit down and play a game. And I'm like, this is Bob. This is just so I was like, you know, what's going to fix this cookie dough. (laughs) So I went into the fridge and I grabbed four pieces of cookie dough. And within five, 10 minutes, I felt completely better. Like headache was gone. Backache was gone. I'm telling you, this is a true story. You know, I'm not, you know, I'm not least, you know, I'm just saying, it's not like I'm saying I found a piece of toast and uh, it had Tom Hanks face on it. No, this is like really happened. (laughs) It must've been it, Jen Beans. I must've been, must've been uh, something in the cookie dough, but it's just regular Pillsbury cookie dough. There's nothing in it. Have you seen those? This is totally random off of the toaster thing you just said, but have you seen those toasters you can get where it like burns stuff onto the toast? Yeah, it burns like pictures. <laughs> I was stuff. like, I saw one where like it would burn like the Death Star. Yeah. On the toast. I was like, that is cool. <laughs> I said, or I sent you that one that was like the Destiny one. It had the, the Yoten as a toaster. Do you have a toaster? Yeah. I don't have a toaster. I throw my bagels in there all the time. I I toast my bread in the oven. Dang. Hey, I mean. <laughs> butter on top and then, you know, keep the butter on top and then just, yeah. Bubble says, cookie dough cures headaches and back pains. And back pains. So be, I can confirm it, Bobo. I can confirm it. There you I'm, go. Out of, I'm out of cookie dough right now, by the way. At least I'm going off on so, tangents. But you know that you cannot light bread actually on fire? What? You yeah. can't? No, it just burns. It just burns on its own. It'll create it'll create smoke, but it like smolders on its own. Really? Like, I've tried so many times to light bread on fire. Like I've taken pieces of bread, put like rubbing alcohol on it, lit the alcohol. As soon as the alcohol went out, it just was it just stopped. Wow. It's really sad. There, I'm sure there's <laughs> types of bread maybe you can get and That's go wild be. with it. Yeah. Every time I've tried That's to interesting. Yeah. Like pizzas don't really I guess pizza could catch on fire because there's grease on it, but Random, yeah. random fact. Anyways, <laughs> welcome to Ziva Games, guys. <laughs> we we got off on the, some would say wrong, but we feel like it's the right foot or we just say it's the same foot like we do every time. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. These we have things people need to know. There's a lot to talk about this week, dude. Xbox was all over the place again this week. They don't, mm. they know, there's no chill, man. <laughs> <laughs> so... For, we'll just go through the week. So I'm, I go. I like to use True Achievements. They have a very good week of, in review. They do their I am. Is it I C Y M I? I don't even know what that means. Do you know what I C Y M I means? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh wait, I, 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 I used. I used to know what that means. It's like. Um, I'm sure if I type uh, it in, uh, 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 in, in, ca- uh, case, in case you in case you missed it. Ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it. In case you missed it. Yeah. So I like to use theirs. They go through the thing in a week, kind of, because that's pretty much all we're doing. And then we obviously, I skip things because some things you're like, "Mm, well, that's not important for anything. But this week, we had had it, Yogami. It's coming, bro. The cloud team hinted that Xbox Game Pass cloud gaming for iOS and PC is coming soon. I know. About time. I it's know. probably got to be. It's, um, it, my guess is it's browser based inside the app because I don't. So? I, yeah, okay, I, that's fair. Yeah, because yeah, they yeah. had to go around iOS saying to use hey, ours. You just got a new iPad. I did just get a new iPad. Um, it it is browser based. That makes sense. I mean, especially if it's coming PC at the same time, because then that's just the same thing. Yeah. 
So does that mean, Yogami, that you'll be able to go on a PS5, go onto the browser inside the PS5 and play xCloud through your PS5? I don't know. I'd like to get an X, <laughs> uh, a new PS5 to find out if anybody, you know. Uh, just for science. Just let me try it out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just for science. <laughs> uh, but I'm yeah. excited for that. I am too. And then when I start thinking I about too. that, I start thinking about this other thing I saw last week. I don't know if you, I told you about it last night, I think. But the Razer Wolverine version 2 came out. Their wired controller. Oh, so yeah. I, so I had version 1. And then I had the Wolverine Ultimate, and I'm thinking about getting the Wolverine too because it looks, mm, mm. yeah, it looks. Uh, I've never had. I don't. I don't think I've ever. I don't think I've ever owned a third party controller. Oh, you know, I take that back. Um, Those Wildcats back in the well, day I've Nintendo never owned. 64. I've never owned a. Uh, yeah, well, I, I do have a, a custom uh, GameCube controller that I got. Mm. Uh, you know, when I used to do those. Um, the Let's shows? play yeah, yeah, yeah. gaming expo. I got one from there uh, the first year that I did it, and I just just sat here collecting dust. And then one day I hooked it up and was like, "Oh, this is great." Um, but for Xbox, I've never I've never had a like you know uh, uh, Wolverine. What's the uh, What's the other big one that everybody uses? Uh, the oh my gosh, Scuff. Scuff, yeah, like a god. That uses, I think he's sponsored what was the by the other one that I used to use too. There was another. There's a third. There was another one. Um, there's some big. other I, small ones that people use, like right. You got like evil controllers. Uh, there was. Mm. Oh, was the one you that Bailey King Bailey Bomb was working on for a little bit? I can't remember what their names were. There's there's like power power A. Oh, or power A. Like yeah, power A yeah. does it. Power mm. A's. I like theirs. There's a they do it. It's. It's a cheap controller. You're not afraid to break. Right, right. <clears throat> Speaking of that, we still have that something we need to figure out eventually. What? <laughs> Just take what I said and what we've talked about in the past. It's something that we, we're talking about making at some point. Oh, yeah. Do you get it? Yeah. Just want to make sure you follow through. Yeah, I'm making sure you yeah. got what we said. It's yeah. We need to talk about it at yeah. some point. This is a okay. So this is kind of funny. I'm gonna say it, and I'm gonna say it very lightheartedly. I don't want anybody to take it in offense, but no, I'm just kidding. It's not gonna be offense. CD Projekt Red shared a little more on info on how Cyberpunk 2077 Patch 1.2 will make police time, police response times more realistic, along with the number of changes. So does that mean that it's gonna be slower? No, <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Not funny. Say. I mean, it does beg the question, right? Like, well, so what's more realistic? I Can they not be know. like GTA where? You freaking shoot somebody, all of a sudden there's cops everywhere. You're like, everywhere. oh my you're God. Star, yeah. Like five stars. <laughs> you just like bump into somebody on the side of the road, they fall over, and the cops are everywhere. You're like, oh man. And then the shooting too. You're like, what is happening? <laughs> yeah, I what the, what I just got here. Um, was, yeah, oh, go ahead. I'm still waiting for the I'm still waiting for there to do the excess thing. So let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. I want Yogami to play GTA roleplay though. So <laughs> bad. Just like one night. Just get full into character, dude. Cause like <laughs> dude, cause you you're how do I explain? I'm trying to say it without sounding too much of a compliment towards you. You know what I mean? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> like, no, you can't have that. You can like I could totally see you like jumping fully into a character. Like and like absorbing it, dude. And like, you know what I mean? Like you, like who was I watching that? Remember that I was talking about Gary Witta. He's the guy that did like Rogue One. He's on the lot of mm. con- kind of funny podcast. He's on the X cast. Yeah. He did a character in there and he's like a British gangster that's like trying to escape from like he's coming over here trying to start again because like or waiting for like things to simmer down back home because the job went like mm-hmm. south. But what voice would you use? I don't think you got me needs to change up his voice. Well, it's, last think, night, yeah, your personality would like would go crazy, <laughs> man. Oh, man. Well, last night I was playing um, this new game that I got sent this week. Yeah, and it takes place. Uh, it's I, well, it's a Polish company that makes it, but it, it, it's all about World War II. It's like this alternate, um, alternate universe where World War II was different and it ended in a different way. But it takes place in 1980, but you're still in like Germany or something, and um, and so when I was. <laughs> When I would read, there's a lot of reading. You would not like this game. I'm just telling you right now. <laughs> Forget the dialogue. 
There's just so much reading. You don't have to read it. You could just, you know, you don't have to read it. But I did. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You actually don't have to read it. But I did read it, and I I read it in a German accent. Dude, you. <laughs> right. Oh my gosh, could you imagine the guys you got me with the German accent coming in there being like a world renowned DJ? You just act famous all the time when you walk around. Oh yeah. Like, do you have any? I, I was trying to go. I went English. I was like, Do you I have don't any know if you know me, But I'm from Germany, and I'm here to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> that I need something better than this father here. You know what I'm saying? Please. Where's the club? You know what kind of things Can I you do. show me where you the club is? <laughs> yes. Can you show me? I do not want to go to the main entrance. Please. The back entrance, please. Thank you. Dude, we have to do it. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the content you can make from that. It's so freaking funny, dude. So my ex-girlfriend and I, uh, we used to do this thing where we would, um, we would, if we would go out like on a Saturday, just kind of go shopping and stuff, yeah. we would say, okay, we have to pick an accent. We have to stick with it the whole time we're out. And then, and then so we, more, the majority of the time we'd be doing it, but it would be so funny because we'd be laughing and people never really knew if our accents were real. They didn't know. You know? Yeah. So, but eventually we never realized that we stopped. We just did. We didn't know that we stopped. We never called each other out, out for stopping because we didn't realize we did. Yeah. We just slipped back into our normal voice. They were like, holy crap. How? And then we didn't know how long we went to, yeah. with the oh, accent. My but, bad. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, we would try different accents every day. Or we do that. But Bro. Yeah, they're fun. They're fun. You should try it. You should try it some night, man. You had to, get, you had to do it on PC, but it's, it's. Yeah. Uh, just for one night, just for a good time, man. Like we could get like a whole, like we could create the whole scene scenario for you coming into. Like we could be telling everybody, be like, dude, have you guys heard? Like this guy's coming into town next week, dude. And like we'll have it like to a day, to a time, dude. That way, like when you come in, like people know who you are. And like we'll be like paparazzi, dude. Like oh my god, <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much, guys. Thank you. <laughs> oh, dude, we could go there. Good times. Man, sorry, we're way off there. Woo. Yeah. Took that bad boy. <laughs> um, some other things this week. So, Fallout 76, they announced their 2021 roadmap, which. Yeah. Oh, the rest of their 2021 roadmap. Sorry. Right. So, we got Worlds Are Changing. Uh, Daily Ops Expansion 2, and then Tales from the Stars comes this winter. I yeah. do. I always want to get back in that game, dude. Like, it was fun. But it was just, I don't know. I feel, do you ever feel like sometimes people's, like, opinions of games affect the way that you feel about a game? Like, your pre predetermined feelings? Is that the way, the way I'm going to word it? Uh Yeah. That's how I feel about that, like about the whole like Fallout seventy six. Like I, I, I in my head thought I wasn't gonna like it before I even played it, and then I started you to have fun. Think you were gonna like it? I didn't think I was gonna like it. Oh, but then when we all started playing it like together, I was like, this is kind of fun. But I feel like it was always kind of there. I'm like, I'm not supposed to like this. Nobody else likes it. I'm not supposed to like this. Huh? I don't know, man. That's just I. I <clears throat> I played Fallout for the first time with you guys. What was that last year? Yeah, that fall when we played Fallout seventy six. I had never played a Fallout game ever. You should that. play Fallout four now that it that's has an FPS boost. That's what a lot of people are telling me. Yeah, you can go four K sixty FPS. Four uh, K yeah, four K sixty FPS. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try it. So that thing will be. I'm gonna have to try it. And I've watched clips of people playing it, and I'm like, oof, oof, that's nice. Be, I'm, I think you would enjoy that one. It's a very big storytelling RPG. Yeah. It was buggy. Mess I like story games. It was a buggy mess when it came out. Like when I, I remember. I don't even know how to explain how bad it was. I remember getting in because I was like, oh, man, I always want to play a game like this. And I was like, it was not the right game to choose to jump in. Oh. Oof. Yeah. Um, another thing this week. Xbox Live is dead. It's gone. There's no more Xbox Live. It's it's gone forever. Yeah, it's gone forever. You can no longer talk to your friends online. No, I'm just not kidding. through Xbox Live anymore. Yeah, you can't talk to their Xbox Live. It's not gonna work anymore. But now we have <laughs> Xbox Network. Xbox Network. So it's been a really funny conversation to hear people talk about because a lot of I've heard people like mad about it. 
And they're like, why would Xbox do that? That's dumb. But then I heard other people that are like, well, I mean, they're trying to localize everything into like, this is what it is. Right. It's like, it's not just for Xbox. <laughs> it's now for everything. That's funny that people get mad about some letters that yeah. changed. Oh, yeah. Also, people are getting mad. They're like, that's the dumbest name they could have chose. Why Xbox Network? I'm like, well, PlayStation Network. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, Xbox Network. That's the dumbest <laughs> name. I mean, I can think of dumber names like Xbox Todd. <laughs> Xbox Marianne. That sorry, could be really weird. Sorry if your name is Todd or Marianne. We don't actually <laughs> know, think I'm your name's saying. stupid. We're just, <laughs> yeah, just, I mean, just, I'm just saying. I mean, if you're going to name a Xbox something as something, you know, that has nothing to do with it, but network makes sense to me. It does. I mean, it's part, like, everything is part of the Xbox network, right? Because we got Game Pass, mm -hmm. we got Live, we got mm -hmm. Gold, which is from what I've been, from what everybody's been talking about. Not even talking about. If you're in the Xbox Insider program right now, the newest update said, <gasps> free to play games are free to play. Yep. <clears throat> Looking for a group is going to be free to play. Looking for, mm -hmm. yeah, going to Xbox parties, free to play. Yep. They did it. Yep. So, I mean, it's here. And I feel like it should be making a bigger splash that it's going free, but it's kind of just like a, like a little, like a skip, yeah. you know, like, I don't know. I'm excited about that one. That'd be cool. It's not like it's going to really <laughs> affect me. I'll probably pay for ultimate for the rest of my life. So yeah, uh, you're probably at the same boat. Yeah. Like, especially now that we got clouds actually going to come through now, we could actually use the cloud. Cause right now all we can use is a uh, game streaming. Yeah, it's still in the alpha, so you got to be in the the insider ring. If you're not an Xbox insider, it's pretty easy to get into. It's one of the little uh, what's it called apps on your Xbox. You just go yeah. find it in the store. Just do mm -hmm. Xbox Insider program; it'll pull up. Has a little do with like a space helmet. Yeah, inside of like a chat bubble. It's pretty nice. But you got me speaking of Xbox Party Chat. You know yeah. what would make Xbox Party Chat better? Mm -hmm. Is if it was in Discord. Yeah, that would be great. And then they integrated Discord with Xbox Live. Think about what the party, like, think about what my, like, when I have my community gaming nights would be. We all have to get in Discord anyway. Yeah. You know, that would be great. I, I This whole acquisition thing, this, I mean, it's still like, it's still like, kind of like, well, they're not really going to buy them. Yeah. So they're saying that from what I, for the, 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 the last thing I heard was Discord is putting themselves out there. To see who's and interested. Microsoft is one of the people they're like, hey, just saying. They got one of I'm the biggest single. checkbooks out there. <laughs> yeah. So, um, but at the same time, <clears throat> so let's think about this, right? Microsoft has what? Well, they used to, back in the day, used to have, uh, what was that called? Was it called MSN Chat or MSN? Oh, the Messenger? Yeah, MSN Messenger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Heck yeah, bro. That, we all, that's where everybody went. Yeah. <laughs> Which worked. Up. It worked just fine. And then they bought Skype. And it sucked. Skype still sucks. I use Skype. Well, oh, I, yeah. I use it every week. I want. I won't say every day because I try to avoid it at all costs. But yeah. even at work, and I'm, the company that I work for is huge, right? One of the biggest companies in the world. Huge. And we can't get Skype to work, right? Like, I can't get Skype to work. Skype Jeez. is a, a complete and total mess. So one thing that I really, really like that when I first started using Discord, it totally reminded me of is Slack. And a lot of companies don't allow Slack, but a Slack, I don't know if you've ever used Slack, but it's basically like Discord. <clears throat> it's yeah. basically like Discord, but it's focused on, it's, it's uh, focused towards uh, uh, mainly uh, corporate, you know, businesses and, bi you know, big companies and stuff. A, a really good way to work, get in and chat, DM, have uh, DMs, have chat rooms, stuff. Exactly like, it's ex exactly like Discord, to me anyway. It, it, there's a... They have their own little features, but it's basically the same thing. Yeah. So Microsoft doesn't have anything like that. Slack Slack is its own thing. So I was like, wait, does Microsoft doesn't own Slack? And I double checked and they don't. So if Microsoft got Discord, they would have their version of Slack. Plus, they already well, they, have all these they users. They have Teams. Teams, yes. But still, Teams is mostly used focused towards corporate. Yeah. Most of the time, only time that I use Teams is when I'm working with a, a company or like hopping our Microsoft team. I'm ne it's never like, hey, we're going to game and let's let's talk in Teams. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Or any kind of social thing. It's more more focused towards um, 
company. So Discord has already got the fun factor of the gaming community and whatever else people do. There's like YouTube channels that aren't even in the games that have Discord. I, I follow one of them. I'm a yeah. subscriber to one of them. They don't, they're not even, gaming's not even their thing, but they have a, they have a Discord, you know. So, yeah. um, I mean, and, and another thing too is Slack. The thing about Slack is all these companies that have, have Slack accounts and everything, nobody invites you to their Slack account, right? But, yeah. but, HyperX will invite you to their Discord. Yep. You know what I mean? Like you get people. So they've already got that 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 mindset, mindset. for Discord. Yeah. For Discord, it's more it's more community oriented oriented. It's not so focused on corporate. It's more like, hey, we're friends and we can hang out in here. So I think it's um it's it's a pretty it's a pretty good idea. Uh, 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 it's a good uh, a good I think. It would be a great acquisition for Microsoft. Uh, hopefully, they would screw it up. Uh, Five says, "What worries me is Discord is pushing the sale. What problem? What problem does Discord know about? They want to sell themselves to avoid dealing." <laughs> yeah, well, I know that there are issues with. Um, I, you don't hear about it a lot, but I think mainly because people moderate themselves. But I think they may be worrying about um, moderate moderating. You know, yeah. people getting in there. Um, undesirables to you know stay and doing terrible things things get out of hand you know because you got to yep. think like discord was you know started by some dudes and now look how big it is you know Dude, their net worth, i think their net worth was eight billion yeah eight Jeez. billion do you imagine so they're like yo microsoft <laughs> throw two more on top of that come on you got it you got it and then it's yours you keep all <laughs> the employees and just ride it out uh yeah, there's a lot of things in this in that that kind of uh, was it seven bill in 2019. There's a lot we we talked about this before, right? I I, I mentioned to you before. I was like, Discord's got to be trying to sell. Like I was like, there like it, everything kind of seemed like it. Mm -hmm. We got rid of our partners, right? How many partners yeah. they dropped? They probably dropped. You like said 80. this a while back. Yeah, they and then they dropped eighty percent of their partners. They got rid of the gaming, right? That wasn't going to work mm -hmm. for them. So now let's 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 take all that that just failed and mix it with your Xbox stuff. So not only are we gonna have like looking for group turns into a whole new thing, right? Going into parties turns into a whole new things. There's not a limit on parties anymore, right? You could have what was it? I played uh, when I played Black Desert Online. That was one of our problems. Mm -hmm. You had to like when we do wars or like conquests or whatever, you had to have your phone. Basically, I didn't have to because I got a PC, right? But Right. Everybody else had their phones. Had, you could hear people with their like crap, like their phones on like speakerphone, dude. And they're like trying to talk in under the war. Yeah. It's like, I'm like, man. <laughs> but then let's let's take this even further. So where is Xbox going? Right, we're trying to go into this cloud system. Mm -hmm. Where's Discord already at? Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, you have Discord on your phone. I you have, have it on Discord my phone. On your computer, you mm -hmm. have Discord on your tablet. My now, tablet. the only thing that you use every day that it's not on right now is your Xbox. Right. So, right. yeah, it's like it's so many. So now you're going to have xCloud. The easiest way to jump into a party, pull up Discord, boop, you're in the, you're in the Xbox yeah. party. That would be really cool. And you can, you know, have an option to, okay, I'm going to join this party. Uh, and then do you want Xbox party or Discord party? You know, have the the option to pick, like depending on where everybody is or something like that, you know? Yeah. So five says it also makes a difference if they lose core discord people after the sale. Yeah, that's true. The thing is too, like, a, so let's talk about complications of the sale, right? We mm -hmm. talk about like you've seen, and we've seen this backlash all week and it's all people that we've already been following. And so this is, right. it's, it's been big, right? Everyone's like, well, they're going to do what they did to mixer. You got me. How much do you think Mixer was worth when they bought it from, or when they bought Beam? Wait, what now? Oh, how when much, they bought Beam. Much, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a Stagorilla. Be Beam was probably what? They probably bought it for 12 mil? Yeah. Oh, so we were kind of guessing 12, 20 maybe. Yeah, mm -hmm. not, not, well, we say not much. That's all. I, I'd be happy with that much money. But yeah, <laughs> not much compared to what Discord is worth, right? That's trying to to buy a startup almost and to take it to Twitch isn't gonna happen. Like good yeah. luck, dude. Like yeah. you're gonna have a whole lot of things fall into play. Everyone's like, oh, so Xbox is just gonna or Microsoft's just gonna buy Discord and then they're just gonna let it die. I'm like that'd be like 
Xbox buying Twitch and then letting it die. Not Mixer. There's a difference. <laughs> right. That'd be yeah. Yeah. I something that's already doing well. Yeah. I mean, you you can't grow every plant in a garden, huh? Right. <laughs> it's just kind of how it works. Like you can throw water on a watermelon and hope it grows, but if you're not if you're living in a place that's cold, you ain't gonna do it. Well, how much was how much was the 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 buy for Skype? I always wondered that. Uh, let's see. Let me find out. Um, and I, I, I kind of, I have a question. What? Oh, there, one point. Uh, yeah, there, there it You're is. Two point five billion. So, what is Facebook using faster than light? Uh, I don't think so because there's a delay. I don't on think there. so either. So what? What was all the hullabaloo about? Why did they? They wanted FTL. They got it, and they're not like, all right, let's shut it down. Why, what are they doing with it now? Maybe Holy they're going to use it in something crap. else? FTL went to Teams? What? <laughs> oh, that's where it belongs. Teams. Wait, they bought it for how much? Where did you see a $2.5 Because I'm seeing a lot more than $2.5 billion. So the one I'm seeing right now, oh, this is Wikipedia says, on May 10th, 2011, Microsoft announced its acquisition of Skype Technologies, created the voice over IP service Skype for, ready for this? 8.5 billion. 8.5 billion. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's just 8.5 billion. That's whatever, right? Oh, my gosh. I, I, a lot of things, too, I heard about when they talk about the, dude, Microsoft <laughs> well, has purchased a lot of things. Holy crap. Yeah, they have. Have you ever gone through some of this stuff? Mm-hmm. Holy cow. They have purchased a lot of stuff. Fast and search transfer one point two mil two billion in Skype. Yammer social social networking. I don't even know what Yammer is, but it costs one point two billion dollars. <laughs> Skype <laughs> Skype was purchased. Oh, I remember Yammer. Skype was purchased for that much money. It was still more money than it cost to purchase Nokia. <laughs> Yo, what's and up, Max? <laughs> totally Your company garbage. went to Teams. Mojang, yeah, uh, um, Mojang was only two point five billion. Yeah, I think my my company is going to Teams too. X, I think uh, the, the big company they talked about it recently. We're Take, rid of okay, Skype. Real, I know we're talking about money, big money things. How much do you think LinkedIn cost? I don't know. Dude, they purchased LinkedIn twenty six billion dollars. Golly. I just want, you know. Holy crap, bro. What a. I'm just going through all of these. Sorry. Sorry if you guys are all listening. We're just going in. This is just fun. What? No way. That can't be right. No way. Oh, no, no. That makes sense. Okay, never mind. I'm looking at a different number. I was like, whoa. GitHub costs $7.5 billion. Uh, affirmed networks, which is their five five G networking, one point three billion, and then the latest Zenimax, seven point five billion. Can I just can I just get ten percent of that? Just ten percent. That's not much. Dude, Come on, seven point five billion. You could survive off of one percent for quite a yeah. while. <laughs> like yeah. for quite a while. Yeah, Tweet yeah. does like point zero one percent. Please, yeah. <laughs> like. Because like even yeah, point one percent. You're looking at what? That's still ten thousand dollars. Yeah. Like, if they were just gonna give that to you, yeah, yeah that's cool. Yeah. It's <laughs> crazy bro. to think about how much like corporations like deal with like the amounts of money that they've just passed. Yeah. Around. That's crazy. Uh, my complaint with Teams is when my company told us to download the software, it was like six different apps. Six different apps. Yeah, it is. Uh, I'm a Mac. I'm guessing you're on PC X because I'm on Mac, so I'm not sure if it'll have the same amount of apps, but. I, I the the one safety thing. Hey JD, thanks for the sub though, man. The JD sub. sub. What's up, JD? When I think about like the Discord acquisitions, like to compared to Skype, this is a different mm -hmm. Microsoft. We you and we've seen it. Like everything's changed since then, right? Like back then, it used to be like you buy your license, right, for Windows eight or whatever. You do these things. Now everything's like every year, pay your subscription, you get all these things. 
Microsoft yeah. uh, Office, same thing. Xbox Live, same thing. Game Pass, same right. thing. Everything's going, right. well, not Xbox Live, Xbox Network, sorry. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Get it right, DJ. But like, there's so many things that I really think, like, especially because Discord is so big. Like, what did they say? It was like 100 million active users, like daily mm -hmm. active users. Like, that's a big number. Yeah. And then, that's what, yeah. That's what, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tweet it up says, live is this live for serve or live yeah live for service this is the way yeah it is though like right like that's in everything else has already done that right yeah just like how many how many streaming platforms do you pay for right now you got me just to watch shows okay <laughs> netflix hulu amazon prime i guess Give does that really count i don't think so yeah. i wouldn't count that yeah. one because yeah, I want to count it because I have Amazon Prime mainly because it's the shipping, the not shipping. really. Okay, so let's say Hulu, Netflix, HBO Max. I think I have the add-on for Showtime. And then – oh, I, I do pay for YouTube Premium, but that's just because I don't want to see ads. Yeah, same. <laughs> and I can listen to I can listen to pod, or shows on my phone and just like – and I can lock it when I have YouTube right. Premium. Right, yeah, you can – yeah, that's another thing. Nice. So I think – I think that's it. I think those are the only ones. That's still, that's still. I mean, it's it's just how it is. But I'm, so. but I'm still playing paying a fraction of what I was paying for satellite when I had, uh, yeah, when I had uh, Directv, I was paying 170 dollars a month Jeez. for for watching two or three channels. Oh, what's up, Because you, you couldn't get those channels without paying for all this other stuff. Yeah. And um, that you didn't even want. And a lot of it was the, the international uh, setting, you know, channels. I'm like, I don't, I'm not going to watch any of that. So I don't speak any of those languages. Like, I'm not going to watch. How any. much money were they also getting from all those, like, not pay-per-views, but like all the ad commercials that were all right. over, like in the top 100 exactly. channels, there was like 30 of them. You were like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just run ads. Exactly. All cool. Yeah. That's all it did. And then, um, uh, so I've been doing my best to not get back there. And I just, I kid you not, I just saw an article yesterday that talked about this. It said, be careful because, because now everybody has got it streaming. Uh, NBC has got it. Uh, Peacock, Paramount. right? Yeah. Paramount. Paramount. Plus, uh, yeah, yeah. CBS. Fox, everybody. Uh, FX. Everybody's got their own streaming cha you know, channel now. And guess who else and has so one coming now up they're here in a little bit too? Sony what has is? one coming out here in a little bit. Yep. Sony. So then you're just like, uh, I'm going to pay for all these. Then you're going to be back where you were. So I'm doing, I'm being careful. I don't need to see everything. I don't even, I barely even watch Netflix anymore, to be honest with you. I watch so much YouTube now. Yeah. I barely watch Netflix, but I, I did start watching something on Hulu recently. I don't have time so. to watch shows. <laughs> all right, well, my, now, since I work at home, though. I watch stuff. Allie goes in out there, man. Let me tell you, dude, really? living room, dude she watches shows all the time. Uh, they're doing their own up, not chef? gaming streaming. It's not game streaming. It's they're gonna be like shows. So I guess they have a lot of things that they've worked with. I don't know everything. Yeah. I don't know how that all works. But one more thing to pull things from something else. So it's like a isn't it like a 4K or something? Oh yeah, yeah, like Blu-ray. Yeah, it's Blu-ray. Yeah, day. it's Blu-ray streaming yeah. service. So we'll see how that goes. But he says yeah. I worked for Dish and I would never have it because streaming is cheaper. It's true. Xbox yeah, yeah, yeah. is trying to push so far ahead with this Xbox Game Pass stuff that they and they, I know they say like we've talked about before they they always say like we don't want to be like compared to Netflix but that's what they want to be right like at once network or once Netflix kind of figured it all out that's when everybody else jumped in and so that's kind of where yeah. we're at right now once 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 it I mean then the payout's coming good right now for Microsoft but you could tell they want more because well. Uh, the next well not the next story but a story we're gonna talk about here in a little bit but like you saw all those games that they just announced like the indie games coming out to game pass day one. Oh, 20, right 20 right, right. of those games are coming day one to game pass wow yeah <laughs> my friends and i share accounts so one pays for hulu and another netflix etc hey if it works it works i stopped sharing with family because they like to when when you when you look at their house and you look at the people on the account and three of them are using they're using it at three different times in their house at the same time, and you can't get on because of that. That's what it's all oh, right. About. That's what I'm like. I right, you know what? Change the password. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sorry, yeah. some water. But is what it is. Is what it is. Um. Yeah. So you got me. 
If you were yes. Microsoft, would you buy Discord? $10 billion. Yeah. Yes. Yes, I would. And Dude. leave it alone. Buy it and leave it alone. <laughs> leave it alone. I, 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 I agree and I disagree. I think, I think that's why Skype died. I think they left because it alone. I don't think they innovated it. You think so? Well, because they didn't really do anything, did they? Because I remember when it switched over, I was like, what the freak is this? And then I just oh, stopped I using thought they, I thought, no, I thought, from what I understand, Microsoft got their grubby hands in it and messed it up. I watched a video on it not that really? long ago. Okay. Yeah, there's this, uh, there's this uh, channel I follow on YouTube called Com The Company Man. Yeah. And he talks about different things like that. And Skype was one of the, he has a video on Skype. I want to watch this. And um, it's a, he talks about all these companies. It's really, it's very, very, uh, very, inter uh, very interesting channel. Um, he talks about like, um, like the rise and fall and rise again of Vans, right? Or, or uh, Champion. Like I remember like Champion was super big in the 90s and then it was like, you know, it was on the shelves that their shoes were on the shelves of Payless. And now they're like, you, you know, you can't get a hoodie for less than a hundred bucks. Yeah. So um, he talks about stuff like that. And Skype was one of those videos that he did. And from what I understand, um, like they got, they started, they got it and then they started updating it. And then just, I don't know, Skype work. All I know is Skype worked before Microsoft. And, and I think that if Skype still worked, right, if Skype, if they bought Skype and really left it alone and let the people run it the way that I think it would still be a, a really good application. But I think they just put their hands into it. And, um, you know, but as you know, they, they talked about, um, they, dis they even discontinued some stuff. Like, they, I think they had like a Wi-Fi service at some point, which oh. they also, like, they discontinued. That was like about three or four years ago. And then um, they were gonna they were gonna do something where they uh, they were gonna update it because you know how like when things get really popular like um, everybody copies it like uh, Instagram copied the stories from Snapchat yeah, yeah. and then now Twitter has, fleets <laughs> right fleets so Microsoft was gonna do that with Skype or something like that they were gonna try to do some like uh, something like Snapchat or something like that but then yeah. I don't think they ever did it. But it's just it's just such a terrible app now. It's just garbage. <laughs> I, I I'm really surprised we still use it in corporate because it's so you think, terrible. You think they just buy Discord, implement it in the Xbox, and then just be like, okay, be free. I, I think they should buy Discord if 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 if, Disc if Discord really wants to sell. If that's what yeah. their goal. We want to sell Discord so we can go sit on the beach. So go okay, buy a beach. What do you mean? Yeah, right. Whatever. <laughs> yeah. Or or again, give me ten percent. Yeah, <laughs> uh, but um, <clears throat> it's, so they should if they get it right, and then they just like okay, you guys, we're gonna let you keep your job if you want it, because we want Discord is a good thing. We're just gonna fund it, keep doing what you're doing, but we got to figure out how to integrate it with Microsoft and Live and all that stuff. Let's figure that out. But we'll let you guys keep innovating and doing the things that you do, and we'll let Discord be Discord. Let players play, you know? Yeah. So, this, so this is pulling uh, the, the Zenimax, right? This is the same idea that Xbox is doing with Zenimax right now, where they're like, we just want your games to be on Game Pass and exclusives. Yeah. Do what you're doing. We'll take yeah. care of we'll take care of all the paperwork. Don't worry about it. Yeah, exactly. Just make So just games. let people do what they do. Stop trying to mess stuff up and make it Microsofty. And yep. um I think that's the I think that's the move. I think that's the move. It's just like my chair's being there. Hold on. <laughs> um, you got, you get, there we if go. You, if you're watching the, if you're on the audio, you got me look like you're trying to do the worm. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but yeah, um, that's what I think. They should let them let them do their thing, man. Let them. But I don't know. Will Microsoft do that? Another bonus for Microsoft is also if they buy Discord. Discord is on the Google Cloud mm -hmm. cloud services. Put it over on Azure. A w or, oh, Google Cloud. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Put it over there on Azure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's already in, then it's already in line with the with the X Cloud as well. Mm -hmm. it's right but there. remember, this is all speculation because then it came out that they were just putting themselves out there and they just say, "Hey, Microsoft, it's letting you know we're out here." 
So, you know, I mean, they could have, who knows who else? Microsoft yeah. is probably just one of the biggest people that. That's what I heard. I heard they were the ones doing the reaching out. Like they reached yeah. out, like they were in talks with Phil Spencer already talked about stuff. Yeah. Maybe just one change would be changing the app color to Xbox green. I Maybe. Feel like, oh man, that's a really bright color, that green though. Yeah. I don't know about I you, think but they like, may keep even, it on, the same, but... even on my X, like my, uh, what's it called? When you pull up the game bar on Xbox, on your PC, mm -hmm. mine's red. And then when I go into my Xbox, that's actually red too. I just like, mm -hmm. I don't know. I like the red better. I think the red looks better. It's just me. Yeah. And then you got I me. Mean, we got something cool this week. I, t I messaged you. I sent you a picture of it as soon as I saw them. It was like nine o'clock in the morning. I was like, boy, yeah. look at this. Xbox puts out these two new controllers. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I'll throw an image man. of them out in the just in the video version, but yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to pull the, and the hoodie, the matching hoodie and the matching and then like the matching attire hoodies. and the merch, dude. Yeah, so we got electric volt, which I want, and then the red camel though. Like I'm looking at too, the buttons are red, like all red on the camel, dude. Like yeah, oh, man. Such, yeah. Is it is the black is the yeah, the back of the that's not right. It looks look at the, if you look at the picture for the the camo one, the back of it looks brown. Um, hold on, I gotta find that link again. It's definitely a different color. <clears throat> here, I can give. I'll put it in the chat right here. Okay. Uh, there you go. That's uh, on the stream. Yeah, there it is. Oh look, yeah, 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 yeah. Look at the like right, really the bright. right, the right picture. That is brown. Oh, it could be. Yeah, it could be like sort of because if you look at yeah, look at the bottom where the gray, the like gray that. is touching yeah. it. Yeah. Huh. It could be like a you know it really kind of depends, but it could be more of like a yeah, dark like a like a not quite black but like maybe I don't know. maybe it looks really good when they put them together. Yeah. Yo, isn't that That's such a, a sick color? That green, the green though, too, the yellowish. Like, oh, my screen, holy <laughs> bright screen, but sorry, Tweedledum. <sighs> <laughs> uh, it's yes. already bright in here because the because of the windows. I'm not gonna lie to you, there. I'm I'm pretty positive I'll buy those shorts, dude. They have those flea shorts. Oh yeah, yo, I'll buy those, dude, because I love flea shorts. Oh, holy bright! Oh, bright green, Batman. Oh, oh, okay. That you, I, I read it as screen for some reason. Um, that I love that hoodie though. Yeah, which really, one? And I'm not really a camouflage guy, but I really wish they would have made that with the white one. Remember that white one that came out last year or the year yeah. before or whatever? Wish they would have made the hoodie with that on there, dude. That would be dope. But this is this is cool. Okay, this when you look at cool. the the other controller in people's hands though, you scroll down, it's definitely black. Yeah, yeah, when, I see it when now. it's compared to the people's hands. Yeah. That's so weird. Yeah. I wonder if anybody said anything about that. Because that is, that is chocolate. Be, that is straight yeah. piece of chocolate on the back of that controller. <laughs> in that picture on their site. <laughs> but, so uh, that was March 20 when those that was March 20 when those white that white and that maroon one came out. That reddish one. Oh, yeah, so yeah, the yeah, magenta, yeah, Phantom Magenta. It's right below it. But Ooh, yeah. Dude, a matte orange. Uh, you know the orange is coming. It has to come. Mm -hmm. Like that's that's gotta be like that might be next. So uh actually I think purple is, might be next. I think they might go back to more of a that side of the color oh, spectrum. It looks it looks like the the clothes the 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 wear the clothing will be available April twenty first. Yeah, so that's what I was just gonna say. So the, the electric volt controller, April twenty seventh, which is next month. And mm -hmm. then for the camo one, May 4th, which I feel like they right. could have done something cooler on May 4th, but whatever, you know, Star Wars Day, yeah. why are you May releasing that controller? Yeah. Why are we not deleting like a Death Star controller or something like that? Like, yeah. Come sorry, on. For those that aren't catching what we're saying, may the 4th be with you. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's yeah. what we're trying to say. So Star it's, Wars Day. kind of a... Kind of a Star Wars day. I don't know yeah. if it's a movie. You may have never heard of it. Yeah, it's it's Maybe. not that big anymore. Look honestly. it up. <laughs> it's a small indie movie. And then April 21st, yeah, for the clothing. I probably will buy... Dude, so I told you when I've changed closets out, I have so many Xbox shirts, dude. I was like, 
I was like, I didn't even know I had this one. Like, it was getting bad. I was like, what the heck? Why did I buy all this? Yeah, you know what's I, cool about more controllers you got me? There's this thing that we do. I don't know if anybody here has heard about it, but we do these giveaways on our Patreon for things. True. And, you know, somebody uh, gave me a... Someone gave me a tip, and they were like, hey, if your Patreon numbers keep going up, maybe you just give away both controllers that month to two different oh. winners. Well, that's an idea. But, yeah, the number needs to keep going up on that Patreon. <laughs> so that, I was like, because this bad boy right here, yeah, this this uh, that hurt my bank account. <laughs> but I did some cool things with it. Did I, ever show yeah. you, did I show you what I did with that hammer? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. I don't know. Hammer? Let me see. Yeah, yeah. Watch this. Let's not find it. So, I used to do construction, so I used, like, my hammer. I had, a, like, my hammer and stuff a lot, but, like, look at this. Oh, oh look at that. It's, it's definitely backwards on the stream. I, it, it, no, no, well, Discord. yeah, it looks normal for me, though, but when I look at it in Discord, but, yeah. But, yeah. It was a burn. I, that was super easy, super fast. I was just like, done. I was like, hmm. Wait, do they not have a way in... um? in OBS to flip the video. Yeah, they but do. It, but it's not yours. Oh, because you have to flip the whole thing. That's right. Yeah. So I'd have to like, I'd have to do a split source poll yeah. and then flip one and not the other one. It's weird. Yeah, I don't know. So that's something that Microsoft could step in and say, hey, fix this. <laughs> what, what the heck are you thinking? Yeah, Dude, why? I got, why is this? I got not man wood. Okay, hey, here behind me. <laughs> <laughs> Even Zoom gives you the options. Go into Zoom. Um, by default, it has your your camera reversed, <laughs> but it gives you the option in your settings to set it not to mirror. So you you know, so I set it off. Like I'll yeah. just, I set it not to mirror. That was a hard one to read. <laughs> I just made yeah. it up, but I was pretty close. It'd yeah, like, Nyet. <laughs> Night now. <laughs> <laughs> Wed. <laughs> It'd be would it be wooed? I don't know at that point. Wed. Do wooed? <laughs> I don't know. Hmm, OBS or MS, which is lesser evil? <laughs> <laughs> Discord's not evil. They just got rid of all their partners. Yeah. But I mean, and it's one less thing to pay for. So true. Um a lot of Game Pass editions came out. Octopath Traveler. Oh yeah, that is. I'm not gonna say it's not my game, but that is probably not my game. But you know, yeah, I, I won't be playing it. That is definitely a huge <laughs> RPG. Yeah, yeah. I never I've played games like that. Superland came out. Have you seen that one? Yeah, I did. Is it only on PC or is it on your Xbox too? Uh, I think I was looking at it last night. I was looking at games last night, and. Uh, I think when I saw it, that I think I had it set for. Oh, here it is. <clears throat> I think I had it set for. Um, here we go. Games for PC, and I was like, "Ooh, I want to play that." And then I'm like, "Ah, oh, it's only on PC." But it was. Um, I think it's only on PC. So when I go to console, yeah, it goes away. Dang. I mean, I know what game we can play this week already uh -oh. there is a game that comes out this week that's kind of a big deal that comes out on the first and no it's not a joke <laughs> april 1st april fool's day for those that didn't catch that sorry <laughs> but april 1st outriders comes out which is Wednesday. that's right that's right you've been prepping for it he'll it looks uh, mean. not wednesday thursday my bad thursday I know I'm going to play that one. I guarantee I'm going to play it no matter what. So probably a good choice for a game of the week because it's one of those games that we're probably just going to play no matter what. Even if we don't love it, we're still going to try it because right. it's on Game Pass and it's a big deal. Right. Um, And then let's talk about this big old thing that just came out this week for Xbox. So Xbox did a huge Twitch gaming showcase ID at Xbox. Mm -hmm. There was a hundred different games. I'm not going to go through all the games. That's a lot of games. <laughs> a lot and of a games. lot of them were like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> but then some of them were pretty freaking cool. Um, we're just going to go through the 20. These 20 that we're going to go through, they're on Game Pass Day 1, which is amazing. 
Um, it was bad production wise. It was four hours from what I heard. I didn't watch the whole thing. I saw like a very little tiny bit of it. But yeah, that's a lot of hours, huh? Um, so this is what we got. We got Art of Rally. I don't know which one that even was. I'm just going to go through the ones that I know of. If there's ones that you remember, you got me, you let me know. Mm -hmm. right. Astria Ascending. Backbone. Then this next one, this was at this was at a, a couple of different packs, but Boyfriend Dungeon. Oh, yeah. Where you actually date your weapons as you crawl through dungeons. <laughs> and that's how your connection to the weapon becomes... You be, you get p more powerful the better connection you have with your weapons. Right. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, Tweedledum. You know, people just do their things. Uh, <laughs> Craftopia. Uh, Dead Static Drive. Edge of Eternity. Hello Neighbor 2. Huh? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Because we have Hello Neighbor. Uh -oh. We have Secret Neighbor. Now we're going back to Hello Neighbor mm -hmm. 2. Yeah, I think they just wanted to give a lot of those indies. So, Ax, sorry, I need to read what he says before I answer it. Uh, Ax said, I think I, I think it could have been cut down to two hours, maybe two and a half max. I mean, yeah, mm -hmm. I think they just wanted to give all these people the the light that they needed. Yeah. If they have pigeon dating simulators, why not weapons? That's a good point. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Library of Ruina. Ruina. Little Witch in the Woods. And this one, this one I've been seeing. I don't know why people are so excited for it. It looked okay, I guess. <laughs> Moon Glow Bay. Moon Glow Bay, yeah. It's like a fishing RPG, right? Yeah, and it, I don't know if you watched the trailer for it. It's, uh, yeah, I don't know if I can play it. <laughs> it looks like a JRPG almost. Oh, really? Yeah, the way it kind of flows. I was like, uh, but there's fishing. Hey, there's fishing. Do you know there's a free game on Xbox that's a, a fishing simulator? A first-person fishing simulator on Xbox? <laughs> really? Yeah, it's free to play, too. I was looking at it. I was like, hmm, I don't know. <laughs> it was funny because when the Xbox, the day that they announced the Xbox Network stuff, mm -hmm. uh, this thing popped up on my Xbox that said games that are free on Xbox that you can play. And I was like, huh. So I started looking at them, and there was, there's a couple in there that were a little mm, strange. <laughs> I went and played one of them. I didn't love it. I don't remember what it was. It was, yeah. something, it was something like, it was kind of like, I thought, I was like, oh, Wreckfest, but it was like driving cars with weapons. And it's top, over the top. And it was, I don't know. It wasn't, it was not great. Anyways, <laughs> Narita Boy. So that one looks pretty cool. I've watched, I watched a little bit on that one. Uh, Omno, Recompile, Sable, She Dreams Elsewhere. And then here we go talking about the big boy, Stalker 2. That's a big one. A lot of people are excited about. I actually was reading people talking today. There was, they were like talk about them being one of the next acquisitions for Xbox. Yeah, so that that game does look pretty good. Have you seen no. it? Uh, I never played the first bit. one. Yeah, so Stalker doesn't actually mean anything. It's actually a huge acronym. Yeah, right. It's like looters, killers, assassins. There's all kinds. Like every single one of those is a different. Yeah, it's. Mm -hmm. And so it's like choosing what kind of person you're going to be in the game. Yeah. But yeah, so I guess they're like a 90-person studio, and they're from Poland. And Xbox was in talks with trying to buy somebody out of Poland. So, uh... Yeah. And they got stuff in their good. they got stuff in their pockets waiting to come out still, too. Or stuff that has what's came the, out. What's the company? Oh, uh, That I'm makes it? talking about it. Oh, I just clicked on something. That's not what I wanted. I can't. Mm -hmm. I can't find the stuff I wanted to find right now. Oh, good. Yeah. Still no date though. Me. It was correct. They do say it's coming out this oh, year. Publisher GSC Game World. GSC Game World. Developer and publisher. And the next game though, mm, you got me. I don't know if you're ready for this game or excited for this game, but man, this game's got me. It's like I, I might be overhyping it in my head, but the ascent. Yeah, dude. Like that, di like Cyberpunk Diablo, but even more like wild. Now. Is it just is? Oh, it's it. Oh, it's coming to Xbox Game Pass. It is on the X. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was just PC. Oh, the Ascent, dude. Oh man, that was the one that they showed us last year. Yeah, I can't remember when they showed it. 
I feel bad now. I don't know. I kind of, I'm looking, I'm kind of digging it. I like this kind of cyber, you know, stuff and like playing this. playing with so. your boys, dude. We got four people in there just going in. There's a yeah. date for it. And for some reason, this site's not showing it for me. There is a date for the ascent. I think it was April 20. No, 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 no. It's in June. Yeah, it's just, that one's in June. It's coming in 2021, but it doesn't show on There's, the page. It doesn't show the date either. Some I saw something on Twitter that was saying the ascent had a date. And then I don't know why it's not on this, but the the oh my gosh, we were just talking about it. The extinction or whatever it's called, second extinction. Oh yeah. The dinosaur game. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The dinosaur one. Yeah, yeah. April yeah. twenty sixth, we get that on Xbox. That's maybe that that's one's multiplayer not, too, right? That one's on Game Pass. Why is it not on this list? I don't know. I got an email about it. That one looks mm. Yeah, that looks fun. Left Left for Dead with Dinosaurs. Yeah. It's more of like a Left for Dead Dinosaurs Borderlands. Because there's just crazy crap happening all over the place. Um, then there's the Wild at Heart, and then there's Undungeon, and then Way Undungeon. to the Woods. Undungeon is from Tiny Build. Oh. Hey. There's two games on there from Tiny Build. Yeah. Hello Neighbor 2. Oh yeah, that's right. I don't know, man. That's it. It's it. It's cool because Xbox is like, hey, we're promoting ourselves, but also we're promoting all of these indie companies. Right. It's like we work deals with a lot of these to get things for this, but most of them. Do you think Xbox charged these people to be on ID at Xbox? I doubt it. I would assume they probably just invited them. Oop. But I don't know. I always wonder how that works because, like, you know, we did, we did, we've been to ID at Xbox before, right? When we did the, did you go? Yeah, yeah. I went to I went to it. Were you at me with that PAX West we went to? Or were you not at? Oh, that I think PAX I West? missed it with you, but I went to it. Um, uh, the last PAX West, which you which you didn't go to. Correct. Remember, so I went to I I went to it that time. Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'll be I'll be vaccinated for PAX. Pax West this year, Pax East. Even if I decide to go to Boston, Boston. If we get it, that's if they yeah, get, if it we get it. Yeah, I don't know. But September, let's do this. I'm ready to go to Pax. I wanted to go to these gaming conventions. I miss them, man. Yeah, it was so much fun. I really miss them. It sure. sucks though. I mean, I I hate to harp on Mixer because I can't stand it when people do it all on their on their you know, all the time, uh, let it go, you know, just let it go. But it just sucks that when we're going to PAX now, we don't have that common, like that, that bond, you know what I mean? That, Hey, we're all with this group, you know what I mean? So we're, yeah. everybody's so much scattered now that and you don't um, have a hub. There's no hub. Don't have the PAX. hub. Right. We had a hub and we had, we had those, uh, we had some benefits and some perks of, of being part of that group. So it, things are going to be different this time, but I'm, I'm still looking forward to it. I, I want to go and I want to hang out. I want to see new games. I want to play new games. I want to make new content from the from those events. So, yeah, yeah, yep. We'll see. I hope, uh, hope we get some soon. Yeah. So we don't need a hub, bro. We'll be working at these things now. We're gonna be. I got you. Got you. Got a cameraman. Look at. Look, I'm right here, bro. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not yeah. any good in front of a camera, but I can hold a camera. Yeah, we made. I made a video. Remember. Lad, it was oh, the year yeah, that we met. Yeah, yeah, it was the year yeah, that we yeah. met. I made the video about, um, what was the name of that? I think it was QC Games. QC Games. <laughs> uh, something like a portal, or but, but it, was, it was called, uh, um, what do you call it? Like when you go across and, oh, man, something like gate or something. <laughs> Breach. Breach, yeah, that's what it was. Hey, Breach. Five got it. Five wasn't five, even there. Dude. He knows what it is. <laughs> five, tame, five just needs. It's not five. It's a magic number. It's five. I'm a Wikipedia. That's what we should change hey, your name to. Got him. Uh, but yeah, and I made a video. And you were in it. Remember that? Because you were oh, you're sure. the one that we. That's that was the year that DJ and I met for the first time in person ever, and um, uh, you got me. You you hooked me up, man. You got me in a few things, and you got me to go with you to go to the bridge thing. 
Um, cause I didn't know anybody. I didn't know any of those companies. Yeah. And so I took my camera and I filmed a little, uh, video about it. it too bad. It the cool. person that brought us to that is a piece of crap. So yeah. <laughs> uh, oh gosh. Yeah. He was part yeah. of that movement and everybody was calling everybody out for bad things. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess we're not going to use him to get into things anymore. <laughs> no, I mean, you know, so I haven't heard anything from forever either. So. He probably disappeared. Probably went back yeah. to went to go get a different job. <laughs> He's like, hey, yeah. it's time to get out of gaming. Yeah. Sucks. But I'm not going to be able to use my looks to get us into things anymore. You got me. <laughs> got this dad bod coming in. <laughs> Looks a little bit Oh, uh, whatever. A little, a little less attractive. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> well, you got me. We played a yes. game this week. We did. Um, we did. So, I want. I wish I would have played more of it. Really? Because when I look at it, okay, listen to this. Metacritic ninety three. IGN ten out of ten. No, Gamespot nine out of ten. What did I miss? What did I miss? How far did you go? Far enough. I just could not. I did not like it at all. Like this, is like uh, this is a <laughs> well, slog, this is, man. Well, this is 2015. Tweedledum, Undertale, the game we played the week. Undertale. Undertale. So oh, was that? That's when they. That's when they ranked it back then. Mm-hmm. Release oh, okay. date for that game was September 15, 2015. So it says, ago. Undertale is a two-day role-playing game created by indie developer Toby Fox. The player controls a child who has fallen into the underground, a large secluded region under the surface of the earth, separated by a magic barrier. The player meets various monsters during the journey back to the surface. Some monsters might engage the player in a fight. The combat system, you get it? There's a key word there. Some. It's weird. Some. Let me tell you. You need right. to play the game. It's weird. <laughs> yeah. The combat system so involves the player here navigating through many bullet hell attacks by the opponent. They can opt to pass fire, subdue monsters in order to spare them instead of killing them. These choices affect the game with the dialogue, characters, and story changing based on the outcomes. Yeah, you need to play it further. Five. I tried. I tried two, three nights. I tried it, and I was just I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. I tried last night. I played it five, and I was just like, man, it's hard to be like. It's a. It's a. It's a. It's a. This kind of game because it's like. It's that, and then it's that, and then it's that, yeah. and then it's that, and then it's that. Yeah, it's yeah. Like, you got platforming mo- moments in there. Mm-hmm. You got, he said, bullet hell. You've got, you got your two D role playing. You've got Pokemon battles. Like it feels like in yeah. there. Like it's just like but that's all a lot. All of that stuff though. That's all. None of that is stuff that appeals to me. That's the thing too. So most of the things puzzle that game appeal- that appealed to you. There's puzzles, uh, in it. but the puzzles weren't like the end of the puzzles. I, you know what I mean? Yeah. Plus, I like I love 3D puzzles. You know what I mean? Like sure. FPS, first person, first person puzzle games. That you know what I mean? I love those kind of uh, those kind of games. But I just there's a lot of things about these games that I'm not that don't appeal to me. This game that doesn't appeal to me anyway. And then the fact that it was like this whole 2D. But I will <laughs> say this. I will say this. You know what kept me playing the game? What the music? The music yeah. was so nostalgic. Like it kept, t- it, I'm not kidding. I would play that game and it kept making me think about like Punch Out and all these other games. I really liked the music back in the day. Yeah. One of my favorite games back in the day was a game called Secret of Mana. It was on uh, Super yep. Nintendo. And I love the freaking music for that game. You know, I played that game all the way through. Uh, Megalovania, is, yeah. And so the music, I just, I, I really love the music. I'm not kidding. There was one I had, I had to do some stuff, um, so I left the game playing. <laughs> I left it on just so I could hear the music while I was doing some yeah. other stuff. But eventually, I got it. I, it's just it's just not for me. And I know that there's a mar- there's a crowd for that. Game. I know so there is. Just let's uh, uh, let's put this into perspective, right? How many people yeah. review a game? What would you say like the percentage of people that play a game review a game? Probably like one in uh, ten. Oh man, probably if yeah. yeah. Okay, they have a ten out of ten on Steam. At a hundred and twenty-five thousand reviews, what, <laughs> dude? <laughs> Imagine I'm gonna how go much in there and mess up the average. This guy has <laughs> made, dude. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So, I mean, it, the thing is, is I'm I'm not trashing the game. It just wasn't for me. 
just wasn't for me. I got it. I saw what it was. I, I get it, but there's not enough about it that makes me want to play it more. Did he you know, make this game by himself? I think he did. What the heck, dude? So what <laughs> other games has he made? I'm trying to look. He's got he's got like top songs. So Meg- Megalovania is he made that song. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. He Dang. made the song. And, and I thought I liked the song. I like him it. are almost the exact same age. Yeah. Well, dude. Okay, so he's made music for Pokemon Sword and Shield, Super Smash Brothers, Little Town Hero, Escaped Chasm, and Hive Swap. He has a wow. song on Pokemon Sword and Shield. <laughs> yeah. And he made a game that made him way too much money. He also has a game that looks similar. It's called Delta Rune. Uh, it looks like that came out just very recently. Actually, Delta Rune came out. Oh, no, 2018. Is that another game I won't be playing? <laughs> uh, probably. It looks. It looks like it's probably the same game. Yeah. Nintendo the t- the title looks the exact same. Yeah. Dude, I mean, I get it. I understand what the game is for, and I'm not trashing the game. It just was not for me. It. <sighs> I enjoyed it. I didn't have any time this week, dude. This week was bad for me, bro. Yeah. Like, even my weekend was like, today is so scheduled, dude. Like, so today's my wife's birthday. So we woke up, mm-hmm. we went to church. I'm looking at the time because I don't have my other clock up yet. I need to put it somewhere. I don't know what I'm going to put it at. I haven't really thought this through yet. Maybe I'll just put it like up there so I can just like look up at it. But like, yeah. So I'm like trying to look at that clock for my time today. So like, I had church at what? We left for church at 1030. I got done with church. I had to go to my friend's house. From my friend's house, we had to get back to get here so I could do the podcast. I was late. Blair needs to take a nap. Chloe needs to take a nap. Babies eat a lot, if you didn't know. Like, the sixth month, like, Chloe eats a lot. So we had to worry about that. (laughs) And then after this, as soon as Blair wakes up, we got to go to Allie's sister's house to go have cake because it's Allie's birthday. Then we're going to my parents' house to have dinner. And then we'll probably watch Falcon Winter Soldier. And so, yeah. Oh, you haven't watched it yet? I haven't watched this week's episode. Oh, uh, okay. I haven't had time. To, like, I, you saw me, dude. I got, I got an Xbox at like midnight every night this week. Yeah, you were home pretty late. <laughs> I, yeah, I was like, I didn't think you were going to get on last night because I was like, well, I guess he's not playing games tonight. Well, I had oh, a gig. Great. I had a gig last night too, so that yeah, also yeah, yeah. hampered. La- yesterday was just yeah. Yeah. Delta Rune is related to Undertale. Okay. Oh. So okay, so let's let's let's. What would you give that game? Amazing, great, good, not your game. Not my game. Okay. I'm gonna go with good. I'm not. I always because feel so I don't bad think it's a bad. Game. I know. I feel like I'm putting it as a number whenever I say yeah. it's just good. I feel like I'm like you know like we're going like I'm putting this at a three out of out of three out of ten. Like I'm not like. Yeah. If I were going in to review the actual game, then I probably would play the whole game, and maybe I'd have a different thing of it. Right. But yeah, it's taking me a lot to get to continue. Right. That's that's yeah. And that's hard for me. Like I don't there's very few I mean, I'm I don't like story games anyways, so you guys know how uh-huh. I am like and so like it takes me a lot just to to get something in the game that I'm like, I want this. I'm still trying to figure <laughs> out why I beat that one game. The <laughs> What was the game that Which we beat? One? The first one we played. I don't even remember what it's called anymore. Oh, um, you mean the uh, the uh, the rats the uh, yeah uh, what was that called uh, uh, a, a, a something tale a what plague tale innocence yeah. a plague tale yeah like plague tale I don't know what it was in that game that just grabbed me but it had me bro I was like I like that I I wonder if it was the level up system in that game like it might have just been or maybe the story just grabbed me early and it got me like hooked onto it because I was like this is cool this is cool yeah. Rad tornadoes, Rat tornado, just, saying. just yeah. I'm not gonna lie, that caught me off guard. I was like, "Well, we're making tornadoes with rats now." All right, yeah, tornado. I thought I had problems in Oklahoma. They know nothing. So, all right. So the game, so obviously, didn't do too well for us. That's okay. Like yeah. we said, it's not our game. It's not it's, our game. It's Doesn't got it's, thing, game. it's got things that I like and it's got things that I don't like. I don't like having to read and I don't like <laughs> having to watch movies over and over and over again. Oh no no acts. Oh no 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 no. That was our first game we played. That, that was, was the, the first, first game we played last year. That was so our first was game, game. February of last year. Fifty nine episodes ago. Yeah. 
Get the knife. What are we going to do with it at 100? Just go wild, bro? Give away a Series X again? Or not a Series X again, Something. but give away a Series X? I mean, yeah. be, they'll be easier to find by then. Hopefully. Then again, there's that silicone shortage right now. Mm. Not good. Um, well, you got me. What do you want to play this week? Do you want to just do out, Outriders because it comes out Thursday? Let's do Outriders. Let's do Outriders. It's not that we're going to have enough time to play it, but it's going to give us more incentive to play it, even though it's on Game Pass. There's, yeah. not, there's not much incentive we need to play that game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I'm. I didn't play that much of a demo, so I didn't prepare and everything like everybody else did. Yeah. So I'm. I'm willing to get back in there and play that game. I think it's a. I think it'll be good. I think. I think there's good potential. I think I'm gonna start over because I would like to see what they fix because there was a lot of uh, problems. Right when you played that that first part of the story, man, there was like there was. All like the the textures popping in, the textures not even there. Like I was like, whoa, ooh, <laughs> what happened to that thing? And I don't know. I'm kind of excited to see when we actually get to fight. Like remember those little like freaking bear looking things we saw at the beginning, the wolf looking. I don't know what the heck you call those things. They're huge monsters. I want, I'm excited to see what we get to fight later. I think it's gonna get crazy. Because really, we've only fought humans so far, right? Right. Yeah. So far. If only you could sling a rock into an actual tornado I, to stop it. I also like to see what uh, the full version looks like versus the demo. Yeah, because there's some issues, you know, we saw with the demo. I think it's gonna be this could be a good game. I think I think there's a lot of potential there, but we'll see how it goes. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you got me. Oh. Well, what do you got planned this week? You got me. This week. Um, Filming some videos for the YouTube channel. Uh, we got to do a review for the game that I played last night. That'll be another new video for the YouTube Ooh. channel. Um, and uh, work. And uh, right, uh, we got a new uh, uh, you new Yogomi Show Me show coming soon. Ooh. So I just put the questions in the Discord today. So I'll be working on that. It's a it's going to be a, a, the thirty toy challenge. So remember, we we talked about movies. Toys. Now we're going to talk about toys. What was the first toy you remember playing with? What was your favorite toy? Uh, what was the worst toy you ever had? What's your and favorite toy? Where do we get that cartoon? question? In? It's in my Discord. Uh, oh. Just uh, you could join it. Uh, just go to my um, Twitch.tv/slash Yogomi, or you could go to Yogomi or y- uh, Yogomi.com. I think, you know what? I just realized I need to put my um, Discord on the uh, on the website. But uh, yeah. Army men for the win. Hey, that rhymes. Um, I want to see beast battles. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I'll be doing this week. I always think about I think about toys. I think of my old He Man toys. He Man, yeah, it's good stuff. Fun yeah, it is classics. Yeah. What games are you gonna play this week? Um, I've been playing Dishonored too. So uh, again, because you know you can pick. To go as Corvo or Emily, you know, you, I think her mm-hmm. name's Emily. So I've been playing as Emily, um, mm-hmm. and trying not. It's in, it's almost impossible to not be high chaos. Yeah. You got to kill everybody. You know what I mean? It's, it's like fun, they're coming yeah. at you. It's like I don't have time to shake their hands or run. I'm like I got I, I got They got to go. That is a gruesome, so um, that is a very gruesome game. Jeez. Yeah. So I've been playing that. I've also been playing Skate Three. Oh. Um, been playing that a lot. And I think today I, um, I played a little bit of, uh, uh, of uh, yeah, today before Forza Horizon before I jumped on some Destiny before we went live. I was playing Destiny before we went live. So Dang. working on a catalyst for the uh, whatever that whatever that scout rifle, that that Cabal scout rifle is called. I forget the name of it. Skyburners? Sk- uh, yeah, Skyburner. Yeah, Skyburners. <laughs> I was trying to think. I was like, Des, and he does. Sky's Bur- Sky, is it called Skyburner? Oath. Oath. Yeah, Oath. Oath. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm working on the catalyst. I'm at 70 something percent. Hey, you want a random thing you people can sign up for right now? This is totally random. Exactly. I just remember this. If you guys go to your Xbox Insider Hub right now, you can also, if you go to, I think it's called Previews, or no, I think it's Activities. Scroll down. You could sign up for, you ready for this? To play test. Oh. <gasps> 
Lawn Mowing Simulator. Ooh. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to play that game because I just want to see. Because it just looks funny, dude. Like, like you see, upgrade, <laughs> like upgrade your uh, lawn mower, dude. I think it's going to be cool, dude. Like, <laughs> it shows like in the trailer, it shows them like going around castles and stuff. And I was like, no. <laughs> that Toro Red was popping, bro. <laughs> well, that is, I think it's going to be funny, dude. I, I, it's one of those that's just like, well, you know, it's there. It's a way to play it. Yeah. Might as well play it. Yeah. <laughs> um, This week, I will be playing. I do want to play some rock. Like the new season comes out, they just announced like the stuff coming in the new season, dude. They're going like with the NASCAR theme this time, bro. It looks bad, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you. I was oh, looking yeah? at some of the things. I was like, all right, all right, you got you got <laughs> me here. This looks cool. I'm not a NASCAR fan, but like, everybody, you got to appreciate the sport. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Also, I've been playing yeah. a lot of Wreckfest this week. I am mad addicted to that game. We still. did play Wreckfest a lot. Yeah. That is did. such a fun, fun. game, that, man. That game is fun. That might not that might that might not be a bad community game to play. Can it's you like, make pri- like yeah, yeah. Secret, like for private lob uh, Oh yeah. It's one of those games game. where like there's there's when I say I'm gonna use consequences, right? There's always a consequence for every action, whether it be like a positive yeah. or a negative consequence. There's always something that happens. Like you accidentally bump the tail of somebody, you can ruin their whole game. Yeah. <laughs> like completely. And you're like, completely. okay, I'm gonna take this car. I wanna be the fastest car with the best turning, but I don't have a lot of damage. I had that happen, right? I've had so many races this last week where like I was out in the first lap. It was a 12 lap race. I was out in the first lap. I, was yeah, like, I saw that. This is stupid. I don't play anymore. <laughs> that actually did happen. Somebody's like, I'm not playing anymore. Uh, yeah, but Judd, Judd did quit on us. He just he he did quit turned his Xbox us. off. He was done. He's he like, like, I'm out. Uh, but also, um, <laughs> there was a game we played last night where all, where all three of us came in first, second, and third. Yeah. It's true. It's such a good game, though, man. It's just, it's just. It is pretty, yeah. It, it, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That was that's a game that I would have ignored and just like not given it any thought. I probably would have never played it yeah. unless you asked me to. Yeah. It it's a lot better than it was when it first came out because I played it. I, I I told you I bought the expensive version of the game when it first came out. I was yeah. like, this game is gonna be sick. And then it sucked. Yeah. And I was like, well, I remember people streaming it and it being buggy. Yeah. Yeah, it was all. It was lagging all over the place. Mm-hmm. There's still a little bit of lag that hits every once in a while. A little bit. It seems pretty good. Yeah. yeah. There's also a lot of bull crap in there. Whether it's real bull crap or it's, uh, in my mind, it's bull crap that it happened that way. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> then we played. Oh, we played Iron Banner this week. I forgot. We forgot to say that too. Yeah, I still need to finish that. I want to finish it. I actually really enjoyed being back in, in uh, mm-hmm. PvP with friends. You know. Just don't like playing with the uh, randoms because I just, never have a good time. What did I tell Psychotics? I said, bro, I was like, don't don't underestimate me, bro. I don't care you if did. I'm I'm eighty light levels under the people, everybody else, bro. I was like, all I gotta do is hit you in the head with a sniper and you're dead. Yeah, these guys are like taking me out left and right. It was pretty bad. I was mowing, dude. I was having a good time. I was like, this I didn't fun. do as bad as I thought I was gonna do though. Yeah, I actually did. I was like usually in the middle. Yeah. I I thought I was gonna do way worse. Yeah. And I didn't. I didn't use stasis. I think I used. Uh, I think I was. Using, I think I used arc. Yeah, I, I used arc. Slam too. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Good times. Yeah. Well, um, I don't know what I'm gonna say. Most of my mind, most of my mind space is ran by something I can't talk about. So it's like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh man, I can't talk to you guys about it yet. We're close. We're close. <laughs> Yeah. I just wish I, I have it right here. It's right there. You're going. I could just show them right now, but I don't want to. No. I want to oh, build wow. this up. I want to build this up. But all right, guys. Well, I guess that's pretty much it for the week. This week we're playing Outriders once again, so you guys know we will be doing another episode next week, of course. And next week we should be on time. I don't think I have anything happening anymore. So that'd be 2 p.m. Pacific, 5 p.m. Eastern. Yogami, yeah. as always, is going to go do his stream right now for drums. Yep. Make sure you show up Saturday at what time? Saturday. Wait, for what? Uh, your uh, Yogami, show me. Oh, it's not, it's, we, it's not scheduled yet. It's oh, just kidding. Yet. Not scheduled yet. I, I have to give people time to answer the questions. So maybe the next week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Actually, you might want to look at the next week on the schedule. <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> but if you guys want, make sure you guys go check out our Patreon. You can get in on this headset. We do got this headset. It is here in my hands right now. Also, I have one on my head as well, just to make it crazier. Um, not crazier, but just because I like it. It works really well. I'm using it on Discord right now, and I have my Xbox on right now, too, at the same time. Yeah. So it, it does work. It does work. Yeah. The mic's a little, eh, but you know that's okay. <laughs> um, and then headception. Oh man, why are you spacing all these words out? You're killing me, five. And Tissa, patience. <laughs> <laughs> and then if you guys want, you can check out everything we have. Everything we have is on Zeba Dog Games. That'll be your source to find everything that we do. Our Twitter's linked there. Insta's linked there. YouTube's linked there. And I would assume it's not really hard to find the podcast on podcast services, but it's Ziba Games, Z Y B A. Yes. Thanks so much for coming to this week, guys. Episode 59, and we will see you all next time. Love your faces. See you guys. Bye.